Hi everybody, it's Kara, and I have lots and lots of gorgeous ATCs to share with you today. Uh, I hosted a swap last month over at Art and & Sassy, and it was a steampunk ATC swap. And these ladies did such a fantastic job, I'm excited to share them with you, show you how wonderful they all are. They had to make three ATCs, and they could be all the same or all different, they just had to be in the steampunk theme. So, some of them did, again, some did all that were the same, and some did three different ones. So let me get started. I'm going to start by showing you the one that Linda Parent made, and she is, let me show you, so you can see that if my camera will focus, Crafty Linny P on YouTube, so you can check out her videos, and I have seen lots and lots of them. She does fantastic stuff, and this is her ATC which I just love. I love the different metal. I love that pop of color. Just gorgeous. Thank you so much, Linda. You did a fantastic job. Love it. So there's hers. And then I have one from Mary Jo Jornick, who is, let's see if that'll get it, Crafty Jo 106 on YouTube. Let me check her out. And here's her creation. She made three that were the same. She used Gears 2, but I just love how they're you know, even though they're using gears, it's completely different. Love the balloon. Really cool card. So there are hers. Thank you so much, Mary Jo. You did a fantastic job. Then I have three from D Tennis. And D made three that were the same. And here's her take on Steampunk. I love this little almost metal flower, this little bit of bling. Really cute. Love those, and hers are all the same. Thank you so much, Dee. They did a great job. Then I have three from Sarah Evans, who is My Serenity Crafts on YouTube. And Sarah did three that were different, and they're all equally gorgeous. First, we have this one, and the hopefully you can see. And sorry about that glare, but the wings on here are metal. Love that. Beautiful colors in the background. Then she has this one with kind of the balloon theme. She has this popped up, metal pieces on that, and then she has this charm dangling, the metal corners. Just gorgeous. Love that one too. And then she has this one. Let's see if I can get that to hang right. This one right here, which I think is really fabulous. And again, all of these gorgeous pieces of metal, and hopefully you can kind of see how those dangle. Love those. Sorry about that glare again. So there are the three from Sarah, who did just a fantastic job. Love them all, Sarah. Really gorgeous. And I have six from Brittany. And I don't see that she has a YouTube channel, but here are her six. And they're all a little bit different. There's a couple of them. This one is really cool. I don't know if you can see this big dimensional piece she's got here. And obviously you can't tell on the video, but it's a really heavy piece. And I'm not exactly sure what that is, but it's very cool. She's got it all crackled in the back. It's really neat looking. So there's two of hers. And then there is this one. Very, very cool. And this one. But I love those kind of vintage -y colors. They're very, very neat. And then we have two more, which are these two. Really, really cool. And hopefully you can see in the background here, this paper is embossed. And I don't know if she did that herself or the paper was already that way, but it's very, very cool. So thank you, Brittany. You did a fantastic job. And I have, let's see, three from Christy. Christy is twins for me too on YouTube. And I'm gonna try and show you her YouTube information. Sorry about that. There you go. Twins for me too on YouTube. And she does absolutely fabulous things. I'm going to unwrap this just slightly so you can see it. Take one out. She did three that were all the same. They're all equally gorgeous. Here's hers. Really pretty. Love the little flower. And you can see a little bit of the netting there. And back here, it's kind of hard to make out unless you're up close, but there's some gears in the back. Really cool. Love that one, Christy. You did a fantastic job. Just quickly put that one away. And I have just a couple more. If you're interested in seeing the ones that I created at the start of the swap, 
I have another video on my YouTube channel that you can check out for those, so I'm not going to show you mine again. But I had a ton of fun with them. I really like the steampunk theme. I think it's one of those ones that just doesn't get old. You kind of keep recreating it. So then I have these ATCs that came packaged in these cute little envelopes. And let's see, let me pull this one out and tell you it is from Patty. And let's see, let me show you what that looks like. Here is the card. Really cool. She put a lot of work in here, a lot of fussy cutting. It's really gorgeous. And then this background paper is also embossed. Again, actually, I think she's added something to it. But yeah, she's done a lot of kind of layers to this. Very, very cool. And let me just peek in these to see if they're the same or different. Oh, they're all a little bit different. And she's put, I believe, some little die cuts in there for you. So here's this one. This one is gorgeous. I love this one. I love all that glimmer. Gorgeous. The paper's beautiful. And yeah, I don't think Patty has um, a YouTube channel. Or if she did, she didn't include that. So I can't tell you about that. Let me just check this third one. And it is also different. Oh, look at this one. I know there's probably a lot of glare on the camera, but look at how cool that is. Love that. Patty, you did a fabulous job. I love all of the metallics and the layers of things you put in here. And it looks like a lot of fussy cutting went into this, die cutting. It's very, very cool. You did a great job. Let me get this one over here and put it back in its cute little envelope. And then I think we just have one more. Let me see. Yes, we have the ones from Valentina. And Val has a blog. And there is her information, valentinascraftroom.blogspot.com. And Val was nice enough to give everybody who gets hers a whole bunch of little goodies in there, which is a very nice idea. You've got some charms going on, some trim, lots of fun. So here's the first one, and I love all of these little teeny pieces. Love that. She's got this gorgeous image popped up. And then we have this one. Another good image and pieces of metal, which I love. And then this one. So she did a fantastic job. You guys all did. Thank you so much for participating in the swap. If you guys are interested, there's still time to join our June swaps. And the July ones will be up around the first of the month, as usual. If you have any questions about any of the creations I showed you today, Leave them down below and I'll try and get you the answers. If I don't know them, I'll try and contact the crafters because um, they did such a fantastic job. They will be able to, I'm sure, answer any questions you have about paper they use or anything like that. And as always, guys, thanks so much for watching and I hope you have a great day wherever you're at. Bye.